Hello everyone and welcome. I am Panda Pops and I like to bring you blockchain gaming and crypto related content. In today's video, it's going to be a little bit different than the usual sort of videos uh, where I'm going to do one for a lot of people requested, which is how much did I earn on YouTube once I became monetized? So this is going to be my first month monetized on YouTube as a crypto blockchain YouTuber. So don't forget to subscribe, smash that like button, turn the notification bell on so you can see when I go live in the future okay so what i'm just going to show here is when i actually started this youtube so i started it way back when and i was just doing kind of gaming stuff because i uh, i'm uh, first and foremost a gamer and that's what i started doing over on d live which was just gaming streams and i decided to do that on here and over on d live i sort of ended up doing a lot of uh, blockchain gaming streams. So I was doing uh, Crypto Space Commanders, CSC, Axie Infinity, a little bit of Chain Monsters back then, as well as just other general games, which was uh, some of the stuff that I was putting up on this YouTube. And then I decided to do like a kind of Proxima Prime CSC um, ad type thing, just promoting one of the systems within the game. Um, and after that, I thought I'm going to migrate to purely just using my YouTube for blockchain crypto related content. So I always say that I officially started on this channel on the 9th of November when I started regularly uploading. I started uploading roller coin videos as well as Axie Infinity ones. As you can see, it's a lot of Axie roller coin. Then started doing the sandbox. Uh, and just carrying on through that lost relics is up in there as well mirandas and slowly just adding different blockchain games into this i like to try and only cover the blockchain games i personally play and i like there will be a few that i may have looked into that i like the look of um and i'll mention them um but the ones that i do like in-depth tutorials and stuff like that on are ones that i'm actively invested in uh because i don't really want to sort of promote stuff that i'm not actively involved in myself so from the roughly from the 9th of november is when i officially say i started doing this channel because it's when i started regularly uploading um and uh, sort of styling the channel just to blockchain crypto related stuff took me about five and a bit months to get everything that you need to be monetized. So when you have your YouTube channel, you'll have all these bits down here, you have monetization. And when you click your monetization, you won't have what I've got all here. You'll have what you, requirements that you need to meet. And I believe it's 1000 subscribers and 4000 watch hours within a 12 month period which basically means say somebody watches your video at, let's say uh, you have one hour's worth of watch time at exactly 10 a.m today then a whole year from now uh, one minute past 10 that hour will then get knocked off of the total watch hours so it's not like oh within one whole year from when you start to that next bit does it have to be four thousand uh people's channels obviously grow at different rates some may grow quicker some may take a little bit longer depends on your niche uh depends if you've got anything sort of that you've already been doing beforehand like i said i originally uh streamed on d live which meant i managed to gain a little bit quicker at the start when i uh went into that niche as well once you become monetized you'll get this revenue tab come up and you'll click it and i'm gonna custom it for i'm gonna do exactly th uh, 30 days from when i became monetized 19th of april up until the 18th of may so i've got that whole one month chunk we've got our estimated revenue that comes up You'll see here that there is your RPM, which is how much uh, per thousand views. I mean, it says as you hover over it, 
So that's revenue from ads, premium membership, super chat, stickers, and all of that stuff. Now, I've not got like super chat and stuff like that, but you can actually see if we scroll down here, uh, your YouTube premium revenue. So people who have YouTube premium where they, where they get to avoid watching the ads, you do actually get some money from that, which is great. And then your playback based CPM, which is the cost per 1,000 and how much advertisers paid per 1,000 playback. Now, this one is the one that matters a little bit more. Um, and then obviously how much you actually earn matters. This bit over here is actually what you end up with. I believe a while ago, you would then have to work out how much YouTube is taking off, but now it's all done for you. So what it shows there is what it will show in your Google AdSense. And right down here, we get to see the fun analytics. So when you upload a video, um, if you've gone live and right there, I uploaded two videos. And then you can see I've got a big gap and then uploaded another one. Now, what you will usually see is on days that you upload, you should see these go up. And then when you haven't, it will go down. Uh, unfortunately, that one didn't spike up, but it did continue to go up there. And right here, we had a big spike and then a slow downtrend, even with the live. Um, I've heard a lot of different responses. People, Some people say when they do lives, it can mess up their analytics. So we can see within my first whole month. So my very first day, I remember this, I had kept checking and checking to see if I'd got approved to be monetized and was waiting on that. And it can take up to 30 days. So I was quite shocked when after about five days, it actually went through and uh, it was like mid afternoon. So from mid afternoon for that whole day, I made £1.53 and I thought when I get monetized, it would be like pennies, like next to nothing. Um, and we can even click this and we can hover over our cpm for those days now our cpm can change vastly depending on uh the ads that are shown and where people are based so i've noticed when i look at my analytics if i'm getting a lot of views from let's say america uk australia the cpm is generally much higher and i'm assuming they're probably getting higher paid ads the finance ads are the highest paid ads it also bases off of how long people watch the ads for. If people click the ads, you get a little bit more if somebody actually clicks an ad. Um, if they actually watch the ad all the way through, you get uh, more than if they click skip at the first after the first five seconds. So all of that will play into how much you actually get paid. We get a spike up here. We got £4.62 up there. Then it jumped down, down to like a couple of pounds and stuff. And this is kind of like, I thought like £1 maximum was what I was going to be getting at a foul. Like, because I was only at this point, I'd only just gone over a thousand. I was probably still only on like below 1100 at this point. And then it started to get the snowball effect and over the months it started going up more and more and when you cover different things obviously people from all over yeah so that's that i am gonna do the reveal of how much i actually earned within my first month as a uh, blockchain youtuber which is 76 pounds 75 now i was so so happy about this i know to some people they're probably like what no don't be silly that's hardly anything and you'll see like YouTubers like pulling out all these big figures of how much they earn. And obviously you get more from doing like, um, they get like sponsorships and the sponsorships are what they usually get paid more for compared to the AdSense for a lot of people, depending on the ads that get shown as well. Um, a lot of that can, uh, the sponsorships will pay you more than what AdSense will. So I did a little bit of research before uh, doing this video just to double check a few things. And the average CPM that I, I noticed um, is apparently $2. So this is actually above, above the average CPM. So I was getting a lot of high paying ads on this. So we can click see more here and we'll get 
a bigger range so we can actually see what we were being paid more for so the vox edit was that cpm was actually 21 pounds right there and then we've got a few cheaper ones this one uh csc 14 pounds was a high one uh vox edit tutorials was 11 pounds so like the vox edit the csc were doing really well i'm gonna try and grab a small one here we go three pounds so league of kingdoms that was playback only three pounds 47 um oh this one uh the axie infinity one that i did only had a cpm of two pounds 73 which i thought was quite interesting the amount you make automatically ends up going into your uh, Google AdSense account. You need to make sure that you fill out that tax form. It'll ask you, there'll be like a big important notice saying, please, please fill this out. And that's so you, you can fill out the right things for uh, either being tax, tax exempt or making sure that YouTube is taking off what they need to take off uh for it to all be all to be legal then you just set up your bank account on the google adsense and it automatically gets paid to you um yeah not not too bad at all i think it's once you're over 200 pounds it automatic once you set up your bank details it automatically gets paid to you i've actually only just set up my bank details and i do have more than 200 in there so I'm assuming that's automatically going to get transferred over, but I may be wrong. So I'll, if you leave a comment or something about asking, I'll, I'll reply when I know. I hope you guys enjoyed this. It was one that a few people asked. I've also had people ask, how much do I actually make from doing all my crypto stuff? And I will be doing a video of um, another one of sort of like how I spend my day doing crypto and how much that equals. Roughly, it can be tricky to get an exact amount because it's not always the exact same every single month. There are different factors. So we'll do an average of how much i can make and a potential of how much if i put in xyz amount of hours at whatever price if you are interested in knowing that leave a comment down below saying please do a video on xyz if there's anything you'd like me to cover do let me know down in the comments let me know what you thought of this video don't forget to subscribe like check out my other blockchain crypto related stuff i'll put two to here turn on the notification bell so you get to be notified when i upload a new video and as always have a good morning afternoon evening goodbye